Fresh in the showcase here at Swiss Watch Expo. Today, we have a very exclusive Panerai, limited only to Japan, that just came in. It's the only one for sale in the world right now as I'm recording this video, so we need to get into it right now. So this is a really interesting Panerai we have here. Of course, it catches your eye the moment you get it. The ceramic case, uh, the red accents, this is very unique and a color scheme I really haven't seen Panerai do before. And that's because it's not really like anything they uh, make for sale here in the States. This is the Luminor Takachi Soramachi Edition, which is a Japanese exclusive uh, named after their big brand ambassador from Japan, the actor and singer Takashi Soramachi. Uh, now I have a confession to make, I am not super well versed in Japanese culture, so I do not know exactly who this is, but he is a very famous actor. Uh, I don't consume much Japanese content, although if the Major League Baseball owners do not get their act together, I may in fact start watching some Japanese professional sports uh, this year, but we'll see how that goes. Takashi Soramachi, on the other hand, definitely strikes me as a George Clooney type. Uh, maybe I'm just uh, comparing him to another famous watch ambassador. Very classy guy. Panerai is his brand, though, and they are definitely making a huge splash in the Japanese market. We've done the Ginza Edition Luminor for when they uh, opened their flagship store a few weeks back. This one, I think, is even more interesting still. So let's get into that. The first thing you'll notice is the red accents here. This is apparently uh, based off of the color scheme of Mr. Soromachi's beloved bass fishing boat, uh, in which, spoiler alert, this is considered not a dive watch, but a sportsman's watch uh, because... Uh, his big hobby is uh, bass fishing, of all things, which did surprise me. But I do think this is great uh, that they are actually making the brand ambassador watches tailored towards the hobbies of the actual ambassador. Because let's be honest, he probably doesn't do much deep sea diving. So I think this is an absolutely incredible watch and just a really great story and a great way to sort of get your brand out there uh, if you're trying to break into the Japanese market, which I think is fantastic. Beautiful case. This is a completely unworn watch, limited to only 100 pieces. They also have a rose gold edition that is limited to exactly 10, but I do not know how you would ever get your hands on that. You'd probably have to make some major moves in Japan to get your hands on that piece. This one is an all ceramic case with a coated titanium back, which I'm very excited to show you in a minute. But let's get into the dial first. This is a beautiful sort of what they call the sandwich style dial where it is completely overlaid to the, uh, the luminous material underneath. I think it gives it a great depth, and that's great with all the different colors you have here. Of course, the red is the accent, and it really does pop against the black case and dial here. You do have the nodal tachometer uh, going around the edge here, as well as the sweep second hand, and a chronograph minute hand, which is really unique, and I don't see on a lot of different watches. It actually appears to tick, which if you keep your eye on this thing when uh, this sweep hand crosses 12, the minute hand actually appears to tick tick when it moves forward, which is just a really great combination of uh, mechanisms here. You also have your 12-hour uh, counter here at three with another red hand, and of course the uh, the actual crown here, the crown guard, also black ceramic, but the crown itself is also red too. This strap is an incredible looking red rubber strap, which I'll admit is very loud, and if that's a little too loud for you, we actually do have a full set here with two other replacement straps. We also have black rubber, uh, as well as sort of a rubbery, uh, more of a textured, but this is all rubber. This is meant to be worn in the water. Uh, in the promotional videos uh, for this watch, he is literally just uh, just shoving his fist into the water and pulling a bass out of there while he's wearing this Panerai. Uh, so this is not meant to be dived in. It is only 100 meters of water resistance. So this is not a dive watch, although it might appear that way. And if, you know, as an owner of a Panerai, you may assume that about this watch, but it's not. And most importantly, I didn't even get into this yet. This is not just a chronograph, but a flyback chronograph too. I'm not sure how practical that would be for fishing. I'm not a sports fisherman, nor do I really use my chronographs that much uh, for the watches that I do own. But uh, this very thin case also contains this incredibly complicated in-house Panerai movement, which I think is incredible. The fact that you're able to get not only a flyback chronograph, uh, not only the sweep second hand, but a sweep minute hand as well. This is an incredible chronograph, which is made even more impressive that the case is only a little over eight millimeters thick. And this is with an automatic movement. So this includes the rotor, this includes everything. So this is uh, you know, a surprisingly slim, uh, versatile watch if you do like a black case. And for all the complications, not a super huge thick Panerai like you might expect uh, from some of their other larger models. Uh, now, lastly, I do think we are missing an exhibition case back with this one, but what they do include is I think something a little cooler, which I hope does uh, catch up here. This is a coated uh, PVD coated titanium, I believe. And this is actual large mouth bass 
with, I believe, Mr. Soromachi's signature underneath. I can't really make out what this script is, but this is a largemouth bass with sort of a uh, sunburst pattern on the back with Officine Panerai uh, on the back, as you would expect from most of the solid case back watches. Super unique, super special limited edition watch. And as I said, cannot stress this enough, the only one for sale online uh, at all as of the recording of this video. And since there's only 100 pieces of these made exclusive to Japan, I do not know how else you would get your hands on this. I really love and appreciate this watch, even though I know absolutely nothing about Mr. Soromachi other than he's been in some Japanese TV shows and he really loves fishing. But that's enough for me to really want to get this watch on my wrist. And I think it should be enough for you as well. Uh, so do not delay. Again, as far as I know, it's the only one available in the world right now. So you really can't afford to wait around if this is the watch for you. And if it's not, we've got dozens of other Panerais and a myriad of other brands, as I'm sure you know. So give us a call, shoot us an email. We'll be happy to discuss it with you at SwissWatchExpo.com.